Camouflaged into the surroundings, this predator awaits his prey. The flounderfish is one of many species that inhabits the sandy seabed. Meanwhile, along the mangrove shores, the intertidal mudflats are essential habitat for a diversity of organisms. This type of seafloor results from settlement of loose sediments coming from terrestrial zone and the sea over hundreds of years. Sandy bottoms are found from shallow waters along beaches, between seagrass meadows, and in deeper waters surrounding coral reefs. In this habitat, there is an abundance of conch. Some species, such as the flounder fish, live on the bottom, lying in the sand. Other organisms, such as the yellowtail snapper, the Caribbean spiny lobster, and the stingray benefit from this essential habitat. Shoals of goldfish swim in these areas, bare of vegetation, where they feed on the organic mud. Although these extensive esplanades appear uninhabited, they are full of life. Within the substrate exist an array of species that make use of these type of seafloors to anchor, feed, and reproduce. To protect them, we must avoid sand mining, dredging, and vessel traffic that could alter the seafloor. Sandy and muddy seabeds are an essential fish habitat.